Well, guys, um, if you guys are looking at your YouTube, what what to watch, you know, subscriptions list or whatever, or subscribers list or whatever that, you guys will probably see that this will be my second video of the day, and also second video very soon after the first. Um, as soon as I finish making my whole video. I uh, checked my email, got a tweet from Grade A Comics or, you know, Scott Grady. I got a tweet from Scott. Um, a tweet said something along the, the realm of, I, uh, he was bad or, or so, something along the lines of, I feel bad for Wellington. Uh, he was mad after Venom was canceled. I can't fathom like how he'll feel after the Daredevil news. And I was like, Daredevil news? What? I instantly hit the keyboard and was like, let me look up this Daredevil news. And, um, found some stuff. Uh, this series, this series right here, this amazing series, the best book that Marvel's put out, uh, is ending in four issues. It's ending at thir issue 36. That pisses me off beyond belief. But, there's a difference. Unlike what happened with this book, how this book got cancelled by Marvel, this book is getting an appropriate ending. Now, what do I mean by that? Okay, Venom was actually cancelled by Marvel, so that means that you have to pretty much rush your story, or at least put it in a way that you have to end it, or just not have it end. Um, what's happening with Daredevil, most likely, because the sales have been fantastic, so there's no reason to cancel it. Um, what's happening with Daredevil is that Mark Wade is probably finishing the story that he had in mind from issue one. Now, I can definitely respect that. Uh, a writer will, I, I respect a writer who will write his story as long as he will write it. That's why, you know, when Rick Remender left Venom, I was sad because he was, like, amazing on it. But I could understand because that's the story that he had for the character. And once he told his story, it was done. Um, this is different because Daredevil not only was it selling better, but also it, um, it's... It, it, Daredevil's a character that's, he's always been kind of a B hero, maybe, maybe B plus, A minus hero, he hasn't been the A plus hero, he hasn't been, you know, Spider-Man, Hulk, uh, well, maybe not even Hulk, but he hasn't been Spider-Man, the Avengers, and thing, Iron Man, things like that, um, from what Wade and Samney did, he's now an A character, so he's definitely going to have a book again. Um, I don't believe it will be under, uh, I, I have very small belief it will be under Wade's writing, maybe Samney will do art, maybe not, or maybe Rodriguez, Javier Rodriguez will do art on a new Daredevil book, which would be nice, and, um, you know, that could go forth, but I definitely do not see Wade continuing on the book in a Marvel Now relaunch that will be three ninety nine, dollars um, because, you know, it will be three ninety nine. dollars um, But yeah, I don't see Wade coming back to this book because he's told his story, which I respect him for doing, he's doing an amazing job doing it for over 34 issues or 36 issues that he's going to be having done it because there were some point issues things like that um but yeah that really sucks if marvel had canceled this book 
it would be a whole different story right now. Believe me, I am upset, but I'm not mad. I, I, I should change my intro where I was like, I'm mad, I'm upset, but I'm not mad because at least it's ending on Wade's terms, Wade and Samney, because they story tell together. It's ending on their terms, and, um, you know, it's not Marvel just canceling the book like they did with Venom, like they did with Scarlet Spider. Now, that leaves me with now my favorite three books that I get gone in the next couple months. Venom is gone, okay? In two months, Scarlet Spider is gone. And two months after that, Daredevil will be gone. And I don't see any... Marvel Now, new Marvel Now books at that time that I'm interested coming out. So, what the hell? Literally, the, the books that, it pisses me off that the books that I would consider my, in my top four, because Deadpool, if they cancel Deadpool, I would be extremely pissed because my favorite books are Daredevil, Venom, Deadpool, and Scarlet Spider. And three of those have already been announced that they're going to be done. So, the only book I have left that I could that is a book that I'm like I have to have on my pull is De is a Deadpool for Marvel at least. Um, you know, Nova, I could take off. I mean, I don't want to, but I could. Uh Captain America, I could don't want to but I could superior spider-man I could um, and can't think of the other Marvel books that I get um, but yeah anyways daredevil if you haven't heard is done at issue 36 um, makes me very upset but I'm not mad because at least it's ending on the writers terms and not Marvel ending it so they can put a $3.99 price tag on it in a couple months when they re-release it in Marvel Now. Um, yeah. If, if they, when they do re-release it, it better be very good. It better be extremely, extremely good like this to justify $3.99 because this book could be $3.99. This is a just, th this book, if it was $3.99, it'd be just in its price. So, when it comes back at three ninety nine, which it will, it better be fantastic like this book. That's all I have to say on it. Um, yeah, so, that sucks, but... Uh, I'll see you later, guys.